If you're a candidate that believes the Democrats stole the election in 2020, John Oliver has it out for you. The last week Tonight host had a field day previewing some of the more interesting Republican Secretary of State candidates across the country. Though the state elections for Secretary of State usually fly under the radar of national media, much less the attention of late-night television, the position has come under new scrutiny due to its jurisdiction over the process of certifying votes, an issue of concern due to a large contingent of voters who believe that the recent presidential election was improperly counted. Oliver Cherry picked three candidates, Nevada's Jim Marchant, New Mexico's Audrey Trujillo and Michigan's Christina Caramo, who all share a degree of the opinion that the 2020 election was improperly handled. The British-American host claimed though these candidates might look like outliers, they represent just the tip of the iceberg. These are just three of the worrying candidates for Secretary of State around the country. There are many, many others who should frankly give everyone pause because the January 6th committee is reminding everyone just how close we came to democracy basically collapsing, Oliver said. Oliver surmised the results of these seemingly unimportant elections might influence the direction democracy is headed for years to come. It was a handful of people in the right position choosing to do the right thing that saved us from a constitutional crisis, but there are multiple candidates running for consequential positions right now on the platform of basically let's do the coup again but better next time, Oliver said. And if you're not worried about that, you're out of your effing mind.